Hi everyone, this is me Vivian in Hairstyle Channel and today I will show you how to do your own zigzag parting in your own hair. So all you need actually is a comb, just a regular comb, any comb will do, I have for today this one. So what you need to do first is to decide where you want to have the zigzag parting. I usually have it on my side so I'll keep it here wherever I will use now the technique I'm using here in the, on the side you can use it for your middle parting or the side so you can go anywhere the same technique doesn't matter so for me I usually like it on the side it suits my face much better so I will show you on the side okay the first thing you need to do is to comb wherever you want to have your zigzag parting you comb that section backward i will say about probably like five centimeter and then you comb it backward when you comb it backward don't have it too tight to the back just have it smooth just have it smooth and comb this down this down to make sure it's not going in the way and then that piece that section you comb backward you need to hold it with your other hand so just hold it in your hand and then don't have it too much backward don't have it too tight but a little bit soft to the front and then you take your comb and then you just put it on your head don't tangle it down just put it on so you can feel it is on your head and then you can feel and you go to the left to the right so you're gonna feel this zigzag you're going left right left right yes yeah? so put it on and then just go left to the right and the minute you're going to the left to the right you can decide in this minute how far how how strong your zigzag you want to have it you want it shorter or longer or deeper so now i'm i'm showing you the medium size so it will go like this yes left right and then you stop actually before getting to the back so you leave the crown full so and then with the other hand so you stop the comb and with your other hand you're gonna split split the piece yes split you're gonna split with other thing split the hair and you as you see this is my crown you always make sure you comb it backward so you get nice wound film in the back and this is the zigzag this is the medium size zigzag if you want to have it smaller I will show you again so you come the piece section where you want to have your zigzag part in and then you hold the hair make sure you put the point of the comb on your head so you can feel the way you're going to the left to the right see I'm making it sh shorter so it will be smaller and then you open that see this is much smaller now make sure you comb the comb backward this is it the smaller is exact parting in less than a second if you want to have it bigger again you comb it backward hold that section in your hand not too tight again just smooth put the comb again and just go far deep to the left to the right to the left to the right and then before getting to the crown you like hold it take your other hand come back and then from the outside point of your comb open the hair then come down come the crown backward this is it see this is the large size zigzag parting so i like it more to the like the medium size so i usually go more for the softer look but this is also some people like it also a bit bigger so you can choose I'm going again one more time so you can see it back hold it take it open it make sure it's down beautiful smooth your crown is nice and full and perfect so this is me, Vivian and Hairstyle Channel. I hope you like my video tutorial of today, how to do your own zigzag parting. If you have any question, please comment below, let me know. And if you're new here, please subscribe to my channel. I'll be more than thankful. Okay, bye-bye for now. Till next video. Ciao.